my favourite products this time. I'm very impressed most of the time. I'm like, ah, not too sure. This one, a lot of the ones I like. The other one is the Organic Pharmacy uh, Cleopatra's Body Scrub, and it's one of their best selling scrub. Um, it has a very strong scent of rose, basically. It's with rose, um, milk, it has a couple of other things. Oh, um, sugar, salt, honey, infusing rose petal. So very rosy. It was a lovely scrub. It's one of those very oily ones. It's just really nourishing when you're finishing. You really have like a very soft skin. Um, it's yeah, it's very lovely. As every organic pharmacy product, there's no preservatives, colorants, fragrances, or petrochemicals. So if you really care about making sure there's no nasties, those ones are very good. Again, the only thing I have with it is like organic pharmacy products are very expensive, and I can't remember from the top of my head how much that is, but it might be too much for me to put into a scrub. As much as I love scrubbing, as much as I thought it was a glorious product, it's a lot of money, so. I probably don't want to be buying this one again. Yeah, I don't think so. It's a shame, it's very nice, but almost there. We only have three little products left. Um, this one was something I used for the swimming pool. It's a re revitalizing orange flower conditioner uh, for normal hair in a smaller size. Again, because I don't really like going to the pool with like this big, massive, bulky size. Um, did a great job. I'm just not overly impressed or overly whatever. Just really liked it. I like that it was tiny. Um, like that is obviously very organic as usual. I'm just not too sure because I, I don't know if I'll buy it again. We shall see. I can always find out new different little ones. Um, and we also have another Rituals one. I know. Uh, this one is the Loud Say Food Cream. I know food cream is not something that people like to discuss on YouTube, but I like nourishing feet. I don't like the idea of having dry feet. It really grows me out. Um, this one is with mint and yiren. Yiren is a nourishing grain, so it's very nourishing. It does a good job at that. Um, the mintiness is lovely when you've had a long day, you know, when you've been on your feet all day and it really feels like tired. Even though, that's the thing that sort of annoys me, I'm getting really tired of food product being minty, because I'm always cold, my feet are always freezing anyway, and putting mint on top of it is not helping. Um, so I'm, I've been on the hunt for a new um, food cream that is not minty. I have found one, I'm using the Soap and Glory Heal Genius now, which is not minty, which I like. Um, so yeah, that was a lovely product. If you love the mintiness, this one has a very, it's a, they, they call it Chinese mint. Um, Chinese mint, it's just like it's more of a spearmint thing, it's just not the harsh chemical one. It's more of a spearmint, it's very soft as a scent, so you don't feel, it doesn't feel cheap, that's the thing I liked. It's a very nourishing, but again, I'm getting bored of the mintiness on the food products. So, I don't think, I, I don't know if I'll buy it again, we shall see. Maybe if I move to a hot country, because UK is not that hot. And the final one, there we're getting there, is something I'm sad to have finished. It's a beautiful L'Artisan Parfumeur. Um, candle in Mur Sauvage, which is, I don't know if they have the name in English, no they don't, um, which is um, Blackberry? Yeah, it's Blackberry. Um, it was very nice, it was a present I had for Christmas from a lovely friend of mine. Um, yeah, the lots of perfumer candles are absolutely gorgeous. It smelled beautiful, it burned beautifully for hours. I've had it since Christmas. Obviously not one all the time, but a lot of the time. Um, and I think they have really lovely and unique fragrances. I'm, I would be very excited to go and have a look at I remember the amber one seemed to be very nice and there's a vanilla one that seemed very nice too. Uh, and loads of them actually. But they're a bit expensive so that's probably, if I ever buy some again, it's going to have to be a super treat. But it is lovely. Go and have a scent. It is gorgeous. It smells like holidays. Probably because I used to have blackberries as a kid in holidays. But um, yeah, really really nice. Don't hesitate to go and have a look. And I think we finally finished after all that talking. I hope you're not too bored, guys. Uh, thank you for sticking with me through the whole explanation. I promise next time it's going to be shorter. I uh, should say it was the first one, so I had a lot of stuff up. And um, yeah, I hope it was interesting. And thank you so much for staying there. And I'll see you soon. Bye.